we can put the equivalent of 150,000 miles of steering in a vehicle in about 10 weeks here. On the test track in Buena Vista, next tier putting their column assist and rack assist electric steering to the test. This is a ride and handling loop. The whole purpose here isn't speed, but rather steering. Everything from 2012 Ford F-150s to Fiats and Mustangs hit a variety of road surfaces, rumble strips, cattle guards, and the newest additions, which provide a bumpy ride. So our new investment in the past year are these two surfaces. The, uh, the right side is a field stone surface, very aggressive. And then the left lane is a, is a rough cobblestone, typical of a, of a European road. After the experts took us around the track, then it was my turn to jump in the driver's seat and see if I could tell the difference in the steering between a big truck and a small car. I thought this was gonna be kind of overwhelming with the big truck like this, but it's actually, it just feels like I'm driving my car. This is actually surprisingly pretty smooth considering the fact that we're going over boulders right now. <laughs> with the truck conquered, now it was time for me to tackle my first manual transmission. Foot's off the brake. Okay, good. Got it. <laughs> I did well. I didn't stall. Now time for the Mustang, and the difference between the rack and column assist steering was apparent immediately. This one feels more like the truck, whereas the Fiat, I felt like I had to pull a little bit more coming into the corners. Sure. Next tier steering systems are in over 60 brands worldwide, and this track allows two full-time drivers to validate tests and ensure top performance for customers. I'll come test cars out anytime you want. Neil Jafoon, NBC 25 News.